Every year, 160,000 tons of electronics are thrown away in Israel. Inside are poisons and acids that make their way into the ground and air. What we don't recycle eventually ends up, in most cases, burned or landfilled. Uh, burning is the most efficient way of recycling, but the most toxicating way of recycling. So uh, the sad part is that most of the things we don't collect are being uh, toxicating the, uh, the citizens of Israel. In 2014, Israel adopted new laws to recycle as much of that as possible. Now, a new program is reaching out to more than 100,000 school children to enlist their help. Through this program, the children are um, learning the values of uh, recycling and uh, keeping the uh, earth clean. Schools nationwide handed out collection boxes shaped like spaceships and told children to dump all of their old electronic junk inside. I put in a few telephones and some batteries so they can be recycled. It's worthwhile because it's fun. It's something you can do with friends and it helps protect the earth. Okay, but why the spaceship? We want to take the globe, we want to take earth, we want to take electronics and technology. And I really, actually everything really combined into, into a spaceship. And to generate excitement from Israel's recent failed moon landing. But these spaceships reach their destination. Here, Israel's biggest recycling facility. Well, now we're in the uh, recycling facility. Let's recycle. This giant machine shreds everything down to small pieces, which can then be separated into component parts. And some are quite valuable. It's an area which called, you know, urban mining. Urban mining is like we are taking the waste uh, and uh, transfer it to metals. You can find gold, palladium, silver, and platinum. Factories like this recycle about 50,000 tons of electronics every year. By 2021, the law requires a full half of electronic waste to be gathered and reused. And program organizers are hoping to have 200,000 children helping recycle by then and helping the environment one battery at a time.